hello everybody out there in youtube land hello lovelies thank you for taking the time out to look at my video just wanted to start this video off by letting you guys know exactly what my channel is going to be about um, basically my channel is going to be about saving money um, i have a family of six so any way i can save money is good for me so i just recently got into thrifting a lot more so i will definitely have lots of hauls that will be coming up um, not only that i've been getting into couponing as well so i'll show you guys some couponing tips that i use as i kind of learn about it myself along the way um, also my clearance shopping i figure why pay regular price for something when there's always something on clearance there's always something on sale and there's always money out there you can save and there's always ways for you to save money so starting off uh this video i will be having a mini haul um this is a collective haul from uh consignment shops and goodwills that i have been to within the last uh, about a week or so so i'm going to show you guys just a quick mini haul and i hope you guys like what i found so the first thing that i found was a flannel shirt and i just want to show you guys really quickly here it's a flannel shirt. I hope that you can see that okay. It's long sleeve, buttons up. And the brand is by Air Apostle. So I hope you can see that. And then I'll put it on really quick. I thought that it was really cute when I tried it on. When I first picked it up off the hanger, I was like, ah, I don't know. But once I tried it on, it's something that I thought was pretty cute. So, as you can see here, it has buttons, buttons, excuse me, has buttons here, buttons here. And it's, it's, a, it's a fitted, a fitted shirt, um, which is what I like about it. So I don't have any flannel shirts or anything like this. So I thought that this was really cute. You know, just something to put on with some dark denim jeans your sneakers and go about your business so and the first couple of pieces that I'm going to show you is what I got from Turnstile which is a consignment shop and they were having a red ticket sale so everything with a red ticket on it was two dollars so found that the next thing I found there was this jacket I thought that this was really cute. I don't know if you guys could see that. It's the back. And the brand is Tell Bots Petites. I'll put, hopefully, you guys can see that okay. And this is a size 10. And I think I have a skirt that will go really cute with this jacket. See? And it's probably, there's one button here in the front, but I probably will not wear it closed. I probably will wear it open. It was in the petite section, so the arms are slightly short, but I don't really care. It's cute. I have something I think that will go pretty cute with this. So, it's got pockets on the front here. So... I thought that was cute and for two dollars come on another item that i found for two dollars was this shirt here it's a button-up shirt it's kind of kind of sheer it's a muted color which i thought was nice i really like muted colors and the brand is Ralph Lauren Petite. So I hope that you guys can see that okay. Ralph Lauren Petite. And this is another shirt that I found, of course, in the petite section. But I like it because it's a shorter shirt. As you can see, it's got pockets here, which I thought was cute. Buttons here. It's a little bit short, of course, because it's supposed to be on a petite someone whose arms are probably not as long. But that's okay. I didn't care. I still liked it. I'm still going to wear it. And that's that. <laughs> so, you know. 
this is probably something I'll wear with one of my pencil skirts. Um, I have quite a few pencil skirts. I really like pencil skirts. So this is probably something I will tuck in a pencil skirt and just go about my day. Another item that I found for $2 was this dress. And the brand is Massimo, if I'm saying that correctly. Let you guys see that. And this, I believe, is a Target brand. Um, it's a size 8. So this is the dress here. And when I saw it, I thought, you know, it looked huge. But it actually does not. Well, it actually fit me quite perfectly. So, and it's got some type of got some detail in here at the bottom of the dress and it's kind of it's slightly off the shoulder when I tried it on so I don't have any dresses like that zipper in the back so I thought that was cute and for two dollars so okay now I think that that is everything from oh you know what I have one more thing sorry from turnstile these were some Michael Kors jeans. And they looked pretty new. I don't know why they were $2. But I think after a while of it not selling, if it doesn't sell, then they just really discount it. So, so guys, I'll show you the Michael Kors. So that's a size 4. And then the Michael Kors. Um, I don't know if this is authentic Michael Kors brands, but... Turnstile in particular, they usually only take name brand clothing. So I'm going to just go ahead and, and say that this is authentic Michael Kors jeans. Um, this is a size 4. So I tried it on. When I saw it in the store, I'm like, for this to be a size 4, it looks huge. Um, so I tried it on and um, it pretty much does nothing for my figure. It makes my butt look flat. Uh, I do not like that. <laughs> So, I will probably sell these. I mean, $2, you know, for a pair of Michael Kors jeans, I figure I can probably get a little bit back for it. I can get a lot more for two, you know, more than $2 back. So, that's that. So, that's the end of the things that I got from Turnstile. Now, I'll show you guys a couple of things that I got from the Goodwill. Um, Goodwill, every Tuesday, they have a different color tag that's on special. So this particular Tuesday I went, everything with a blue tag was only $1.99. So I was lucky to really look around and I found some things that I thought were cute. So I got this sweater and I really like these type of sweaters. I had a black one similar to this and I wore it so much it's all worn out it's got holes in it so I decided to just get another one so this is by Jones Wear Studio Jones Wear Studio hope you guys can see that and as you can see it had a blue tag which indicated that it was $1.99 it said $6.99 on there but I got it for $1.99 so I will show you guys what it looks like. I hope you can see it. I thought that this was just a really snuggly. I just thought it was cute, you know. Something I can wear over my dresses that are similar to this color when I don't want to have my arms out or if it's too cold and I just want to throw something on top of it. So I really like these type of sweaters, so I got it. Okay. Next item is this shirt. I really like this. And it's got in the back, it's got one of these deals here. And then this is by Worthington. You guys can see that. Hope you can see that. Okay. It's a size medium. I tried it on at the store. It fit just fine. Um, yeah, I really like that. Like I said, this is something I can wear. I can tuck in my, one of my pencil skirts. And that is super cute. I really like that. I found a blazer. This is by My Michelle. 
I'll let you guys see that. Hope you can see that okay. It's like a tan color. Oops. Try this on. It's really fitted. I really, really like this. This is obviously not something that I would wear clothes, obviously, because it's a little snug and it just wouldn't look right. Um, this is something I would wear open, but when I tried it on, I thought it was really cute. And a lot of these blazers, you don't necessarily have to wear clothes. I don't think I know anyone who even wears blazers that are clothes anyway. But, um... Yeah, I really like this. It's fitted. It's cute. And I got that. And the original tag on this one was $8.99. And I got it for, you know, the $1.99. So, yeah, I thought that was cute. Okay. Dress. Found this dress. And I thought this was just, this was really cute. If you guys can see that. Got a spaghetti strap on this side and kind of got some roughly. And I usually don't like dresses that, that kind of, you see that in the middle? I usually don't like dresses like that, but I decided just to try it on. It was only $2, hey. So, I think that that's really cute. The brand name is Collective Concepts. Let you guys look at that. Okay. And this is a size large, and the original price on this one was $6.99. So, that was cute. Okay. This is one of the items that was not a dollar ninety nine. This one had a green tag on it for four ninety nine, but I saw it and I thought that it was really cute. So this is by the brand Attention, and this shirt will definitely get your attention. So it's a cheetah print shirt, right? button up shirt and when I tried it on I was like yes for me this was the score of the day it's got two buttons on it or two two faux pockets I guess well I guess it's a real pocket <laughs> so it's just like that Ralph Lauren shirt where it had two two pockets on each side it's got the buttons here so I just thought that this was really cute. And I guess kind of the turquoise, turquoise um, in mint colors. I think that that's kind of my favorite color. I've been seeing my eyes kind of drawn to those colors. So, and natural colors. I really like the natural colors too. And of course, anything cheetah print, leopard print. Um, I especially like it if it's colored like this. This is just really cute. And for $5. I'm not even going to imagine what the original price was, honey. And this was a medium. And like I had said before, I'm kind of in between a medium and a large. It all really depends on the brand. Uh, how they cut the, the pants and the all the different items is just so... You just never know. So I just noticed this on the on the sleeve. It has this little deep... This little... This little accent on it, on the sleeve. So that's kind of cute. I wonder if it has it on the other shirt, the other, other sleeve. Yeah, so that's just something I just noticed. So that's kind of cute. Kind of gives a little extra pizzazz to it. And then I found, I didn't find that many accessories that I like, but I did find this. Um, this was something that also was not a part of the $1.99 sale. I believe these were $3.99. And it's by a brand called Terra Manda. And as you can see, it's still got the original tags on it. And I have I have absolutely no bangles. I need to get more bangles. Um, seems like when you go in stores, like regular stores, uh, bangles are so expensive. You know, I go in stores and bangles are like $6.99, $7.99. And I'm just like, no, maybe I'm just cheap. But when I saw these for $3.99, I was like, okay. And it's brand new, still got the tag on it. So, 
that was that so that's everything for my haul for today um, tomorrow I'm really excited because I found out that in my area there is a Goodwill outlet now for those of you that might not know about a Goodwill outlet Goodwill outlet is they have everything in bins so basically nothing is sorted you basically have to go in there look through all the bins and see what you can find now one of my thrifting tips for you guys is if you're going to ever go to an outlet number one is make sure you have time uh, going to an outlet is not something that you can just do in 30 minutes or an hour i'm pretty sure i'm going to be there for a couple of hours looking through all these things trying to find some good stuff and the good thing about the goodwill outlet is that they sell things by the pound honey so my particular one in my area um, they sell things a dollar thirty nine per pound so for example if I was to get these little bracelets obviously these bracelets are not gonna weigh a pound you know they're gonna weigh a couple of ounces so you know if I would have got these at the Goodwill outlet I probably would have got them for 25 cents 50 cents or something like that so tomorrow's gonna be my first time going to the Goodwill outlet so I am very 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 excited about that my husband is going with me and we're gonna just search around see if we can find some things so that haul will be coming soon I will try my best to film that as soon as possible and of course if I find some stuff you gotta hurry up and film it so you guys can see it so that is the end of this haul I want to thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to watch my video um, please like uh, subscribe why don't you comment below out of these things what was your favorite piece so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.